Welcome back, innovators. It is now Tuesday, and I do believe today will be a sunny day, and you'll find yourself being a bit philosophical, mostly about your emotions. We'll start with the emotion part. The moon has moved into Aries today, which really does make you feel very self-centered emotionally. Not a bad thing, though. That's We do need to pay attention to ourselves. And you might find that there might be a bit of a conflict between what you're feeling and also some karma you're dealing with. That's because the moon in Aries today is actually squaring Mars transiting your 12th house, which is the house of higher self. Now let's talk about this whole paradigm just a bit. First of all, the sun is in Aquarius and today it's ruled by Jupiter. So today overall is going to be a philosophical day and a day of learning. And really at the most uh, finite point, the focus will be ego issues. So you're really, really dealing with ego issues. And in chapter one of the sun in Aquarius, you're going to be removing things in your ego that prevent you from really shining and being the star that you are. But to get that to happen, there's some background action that has to go. Mars has entered into Capricorn, which means Mars has entered into the house of subconscious or the house of karma. Now, when an aggressive energy like Mars, which is ego-based, enters into a very highly spiritual-based part of your life, it's kind of a flushing out of any spiritual blocks you may have. Last month, you were exploring what those physical those, those blocks were. You realized you had issues with having faith in yourself. You probably identified those issues, but did you solve them, Aquarius? Probably not. Well, Mars is going to force you to uh, solve those issues you have with faith in yourself. And if you ignore these issues, you may find that they bubble up right in front of you through conflicts with others, Mars, conflicts, and or just being irritated by others. So people may piss you off. You may not have a conflict with them, but they're still kind of pissing you off. The point is, in every instance of that case, to really just step into your faith in yourself. And that's what Mars is literally going to force you to do. It's an unhappy transit in that regard. But at the end of the day, if you do just kind of steer your ship into the right direction, you're going to find you fly with Mars behind you. So the universe really wants Aquas to believe in themselves. But today realize that emotionally you're feeling a bit self-centered and emotionally that uh, your day-to-day -day emotion might be in conflict with the need of this Mars and faith in yourself. Okay Aqua, that's all I have for Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow on Wednesday with more Soul Horoscopes. Live, love, be. So